Hello everybody, welcome to the BBSL match number three up against Fatin and his rats. Um, he's got a claw rat ogre, so that's fun. This is going to be really hard for dwarves, right? Because they've already got loads of speed that if like you don't bang them out, it's going to be hard. And then he's got the claw to worry about as well. So like he's got, it's really bad for dwarves. I think when when they've got a claw ogre, it's really bad. Like if you've got a normal team like elves or whatever, then you can just ignore the ogre and you're fighting Skaven, but now it's Skaven like with an added dimension. I, I like the Rogue anyway, um, but I think especially versus teams like Dwarves, it's it's very powerful. Uh, there's my team, very exciting, Guard and Mighty Blow, we've both won one, lost one. Um, now I'm going to try to try hard, and Fymir is back, so he will take over and comes. Thank you very much, Fymir, great to have you back. Stay fantastic. Hello everybody, Hello, everybody. and Jimmy, don't forget to turn off the animations. Yes, thank you. <laughs> Alright guys, here we are. Another game of the Blood Bowl Super League. For those that doesn't know, it's a one minute uh, turns format following the Blitz format, Resurrection. So, teams, injuries doesn't carry on to the next game. There are no SPPs or anything and we have Dwarves versus Skaven. Traditional uh, match up and uh, Fatin has a claw rogue that could be uh, very, very good or very, very bad because it doesn't have block, so it could work magnificent or could be a complete disaster. And not much else. Glorious. And that's more or less it. They miss always dwarf's guard. One mighty blow. Torres layer. Be able to take try to take down the roger, I guess. 13 players for uh, Fatin, so yeah. Three rolls off, Fatin got the fame and everything. Rain making things more complicated for the rats. Does Fatin only has a one blitz? Oh, 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 But this is not looking good for the rats now. Yes, and now Jim is going to be able to 2D the Roger, which could be the end of the Roger career. Classic pause, push it there. But they still, even there, the Roger is just in a very bad situation there.
and Jimmy being very aggressive here, he can afford to do it because the gutter runners are way, way behind. And now what you do as the rats, ball, it's a very dangerous square. Yeah, now Fatina is going to have to work some magic here. Well, Alicia has wrestled, so free Sagata runner, but three plus fails, re roll. Here we go, lads. Okay, six. Not going well for the rats here. Ah, double pow. Another uh, push or something like that will be very, very bad. Claw does nothing. And now the classic three plus uh, dodges from the rats, which everybody knows as 100%. Targeting the gutter runners, three dice, beautiful tackle. That's one go. I bet yes, all my points now. that Jimmy wins. Jimmy is entering the rat's half of the pitch. Cover there, the, the gutter runner there, because we'll be able to run very, very far. Be careful, doesn't want to give any chain, Roger. And now the rats are gonna need some dice rolls if they wanna try to achieve anything. Very bad situation for Fat in here. Already running out of time. Oh, and not. I roll that. That's a lot of free hits for the dwarfs. And this could end, this turn could be end very, very bad. The rocket's going down.
que me vino arruinado. De Willis Griffin, Jimmy Another Free Hit. Not lucky with the block dice, but uh, having luck with everything else. But in uh, proving that's a uh, true professional blue ball, being absolutely tired of this shit, as a proper blue ball coach has to do. Very lucky the thrower. 70 chance to get it going down and now armor break two GFIs to hit the ball oh first one fails that's you have to roll that I mean you're committed there and now the ball in trouble not much trouble it's a three plus two plus run away but When the storming with mighty blow tackle has been lying on the ground all the time because there is no point getting him up. And the problem here is the gutter runner that has the ball is the gun with guard, so that limits a lot the chances of uh, fighting, trying to get some blocks or. Uh, some support. Good. Last. Dodge. Not very complicated. The screen is looking better. Not much, but you have to do what you have to do. to wild animal and of you well no much to say here Beautiful chain push to be able to get a hit on the ball. And a removal. Seems that Jimmy remembers how to play blue ball. Not relevant, nothing is going to change. The ball is going to get hit anyway. Two dice. With mighty blow, reroll. There you go. Another removal. Bola. What is going the ball? Oh, power up there. Power up. Fatin putting all the eggs on this basket. Now Jimmy seems he's in control, but the problem with the rats is a gutter runner can do a lot of stuff. Oh, 
de you go, de Princess White, de... Oh... Not even the rain affected that. That was a complete one in nine. A one and a two. Jesus Christ almighty, I think uh, Fatin is so tired of this shit, that is... Yep. Okay, that was a quick game, ladies and gentlemen. I can't blame Fatin <laughs> for this, but... <laughs> Jesus, he has some chances there, I have to say. Oh dear. <laughs> oh dear. Oh dear, oh dear, we played... Oh! It appears, it appears I've managed oh, to invite God. the only person who likes Blood Bowl less than I do. <laughs> there you go, Fatir. That's, that's enough. I, I don't want to suffer anymore. <laughs> wow. Wow. It's a bit of a shame, isn't it? A uh, little shame, but uh, if the price was to have had you know suffer the whole game and uh, be uncomfortable of having a living hell <laughs> it's not worth it. server error. <laughs> that's why i had zero zero don't worry i'm gonna give myself the admin win here <laughs> what a master play of fat enjoying you know to the server in the game <laughs> going for the draw <laughs> <laughs> the best thing about BBSL is it's the one league I can't be fucked out of scheduling or, you know, admin results or anything like that. <laughs> it's the one fucking thing that I can't be fucked on. So <laughs> okay, well, it's it's it looks like it's got the 2-0 anyway. Um, oh, I guess not until I uh, confirm. I can't confirm. Yeah, no, so there's no confirm. Fantastic, so would have been fucked. Oh no, it's waiting confirmation. Except neither of us can confirm it, I guess. Oh well. Oh, there, there we go, look. You can validate that. And the other Whoa. one hasn't been validated either. That was, uh, that was Rick beating, uh, Flicky, wasn't it? The other one. And we've still got Chunter versus Singolo um, to play each other. But there you go. It was a win, yeah. That was definitely a win. I mean, you know, it sucks. Obviously, the conceit kind of sucks in terms of the enjoyment of the game. But I mean, it was a conceit, wasn't it? He didn't want to fucking play it. So, like, that's it. I mean, you can't. It was looking very bad for Fat in that. In that time, he has maybe a chance to do some crazy rolls. Yeah. You know, it's cabin bullshit, but yeah, like... Yeah, it was it was low chances, wasn't it? Like, you had to do what? A 4 plus dodge, 5 plus pick up, and then lob it, and then that was the start of it. Um, that was the start of what he had to do, so yes, yeah. Yes, was... <laughs> <laughs> So yeah, he had, some, he had some horrible luck. I mean, he could have re-rolled it up skulls, couldn't he? And he could have, like, made the ball pick up a bit safer or whatever, but... Um... Once he just went down the dub skulls and not re-rolling it, then that was like rolling a quads, really, because it was pretty disastrous, wasn't it? Um, yes, no, no, it was uh, that uh, opening roll with uh, double skulls was like, I mean, he could afford to not uh, roll it, but maybe he could have protected the ball or move something else, someone else close yeah. to the ball before making any roll. Yeah, like do some safe moves before you do it if you're going to eat it. That was the thing. Sexy chain, yeah, thanks. Yeah, I, I couldn't believe when he stood it up. I was like, I was like, you, let's hope he, uh, let's hope he stands up here. And I just couldn't believe he did stand up and not dodge. So yeah, that was obviously once he'd done that, he probably fucking kicked himself, didn't he? And that's probably you know a bit like my game versus Andy, right? When I uh, when I made that mistake, that just fucking pissed me off. That I'd fucked it up. And that probably so like already he's getting the dice he's not he's getting the shit dice he's not really you know feeling it and then he makes a fuck up like that he's probably like oh fuck this and then that's why he conceded so For, I understand I understand better than most people. <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. So yeah, some respect Fatim for saying you know what fuck it. <laughs> yeah, I can definitely relate. So yeah, there you go. Um, sorry, Fatim, and uh, yeah, I guess sorry viewers. You know, in the same way as I fucked up uh, the final of the last one. 
there you go, there's another fucked up game. Um, but never mind, thank you very much, Fime, here for doing the commentary, and thanks for watching, everyone. Don't forget to do it here. Thank you very much. And stay fantastic.